All right, guys, so we're going to do a morning routine with six of the babies. I've got six bottles here. Oops. And these ones wanted to fall down. I just, seriously? I just um, finished heating up their formula. So now we just got to get all six of the babies fed and changed. And uh, what a task this is going to be. Because changing six babies, feeding six babies, is going to be a lot of work. Just changing one and feeding one alone is a lot of work. But I'm not able to do my full collection because I didn't change them all last night into pajamas. However, six babies is going to be plenty of babies. Okay, so here's all of their stuff I have ready for getting them all changed. Oh, I need to get her shoes and socks, but six outfits, six diapers. And we have baby number one here, which is Nikolai. So I'm not sure, I'm not sure if I'll be talking through the whole thing, if I'll be talking through the whole thing, because I tend to sometimes run out of things to say. So, um, let's see. Okay, so, um, yes. I just went and got the shoes for Lily's dress. But we have his outfit. Oh, I am so not prepared. I should feed him before I put him in his outfit. Okay, back with his bottle. Jeez, hopefully I haven't forgotten another thing. So, I'll just get him fed here. This little guy. He doesn't eat very much, because he's a small fry. But, um... Oh my gosh, I woke up at like 4 in the morning and my lips were sealed shut from my cold. It was an awful feeling. It's really warm. I know. That's why it's I opened hot. that window. You think the fans make yeah, it more warm? Pushing it right here, yes. It's oh. pushing the hot air out. There. You can turn that off then. I thought I would turn the fan on to make it cooler in here. If you yeah, you can. Well, it didn't though. Push the hot air on. That is pushing on the hot air now. <laughs> Okay, so I think that he has had enough. He's still sleeping. Oh, anyway, so I woke up at 4 in the morning. Oh, so congested. I got up and um, took some medicine. I stayed up till like, I don't know, close to 5.30, I think. And then I went back to bed. But it was awful. Awful feeling. Um, right now, I feel relatively good. I mean, I'm good enough to make this video that I really thought that I was going to get in over my head with, but it's a challenge I want to do. So I got him a diaper, change him out of his Christmas lights diaper, and put him in this newborn pamper. He's so cute. <laughs> the way he crosses his legs over. Let me change him. Um, there we go. I he should have a preemie diaper, but I don't. I don't have any preemie diapers. I need to get some. They're all gone. Okay. Well, we are almost through baby number one of this um, challenge. I have to go look and see who requested a... <sighs> no, they requested a day in the life <laughs> with all my babies. I was like, oh man, that would really be a lot of work. This is such a cute sleeper. He hasn't worn this sleeper yet. I don't know why. Oh, I think because I'd been putting him in newborn clothes and, well, and I don't change them every day, so they tend to stay in their outfits for a couple days. Okay, so cute. And this is a preemie size sleeper. Okay, there we go. Oh, look at you. You're looking so cute. That's a nice color on you. And then we have his hat. Too cute. All right, now we got Mr. Ethan up. 
is ready for his feeding. We're going to use a Suavenex bottle with him this morning. Okay, there we go. He's just going to have some breakfast so we can get him. Okay, he's just going to have some breakfast here so we can get his diaper and outfit changed. And it's raining here. I don't know if I told you guys that in the uh, when I was changing Nikolai. It is raining here. It's been raining a lot here in California, which is totally good because you guys know that we're in drought. I'm not really sure if we would still be in drought right now or what. But the lakes are filling up and there's snow on the mountains. So that is um, a good thing for us. All right, so we've got Ella here enjoying her morning <coughs> breakfast. Ethan has changed into this cute little outfit, and this is a um, mother's care outfit. It's really sweet, and it has little bunnies on the knees, which she's going to wear a bunny outfit today too, so they're going to kind of coordinate. So they're both going to look super cute together. And she's almost done with her bottle. She just got a little bit left in there.
Okay, so <clears throat> got baby Ryan. He just had his bottle. We're gonna put him in this. I believe this is a mother care outfit. Let me check. Yeah, it is. Okay, it's really cute. It's like um velvet material, and then the onesie with the little animals on there. Super cute. It's one of my favorite outfits that I have. Get him change out of his PJs. I know, we were just putting these last night. And I forgot. I forgot to change Ella's diaper. <laughs> I was uh, looking at the diapers right now. I'm like, oh, that's what I forgot. Her diaper. Oh, well, next time I will change her diaper. So we have gotten four out of the six babies changed now. Getting all these kids out of their Christmas diapers. They must not have had a poop diaper since Christmas time. And I'm putting on this diaper, I believe it's from Australia. Looks kind of big, but it'll work for him. It's got all these little safari animals on so it matches his outfit which that was not planned. I don't typically match their diapers to their outfits but whatever it'll work for now. Okay so I'll put this onesie on him.
you notice him commenting. <laughs> All right, we're to our final baby, baby number six. And that wasn't too bad to do a morning routine with six reborns. Um, I thought it was gonna be more challenging. I don't know why. It's not like they wiggle around or anything. But um, we made it to the last one, which is baby Willie. She's finally going to wear her new outfit that I bought her. Um, I don't think I'm going to change her diaper because I just put on this diaper that she has. <laughs> and it's an out-of-country diaper, so I don't want to... I guess I could put it away and use it again, but it never happens that way. Sometimes it does. So we're going to put on her pantyhose. And I got her shoes and socks that she's going to wear this cute dress that I got for her um, at Jimboree uh, the last time, one of the times we were at the mall. So it's a sweatshirt material dress, so it definitely will be warm. It's got some pink bloomers to wear. It's very cute. I think these colors are gonna look really nice on her. Well, pretty much anything looks really awesome with her super pale skin tone. I like it a lot. Okay, let's unbutton it so we don't mess her up too bad. I had just brushed it before the video, which I don't know why I was doing that. But I do need a little pink headband would be cute. Which I didn't bring one out of the room. So maybe I'll go get that later. Okay, there we go. She has bed head. Okay, so we got two buttons. Two buttons here. All right. Oh, so cute. It's like a snow leopard. And then we have our frilly socks because she's a frilly girl. She likes to wear her ruffly socks with her Mary Janes. Looks adorable. She's just a girly girl. You know. She's got some patent leather white Mary Janes to wear with this. It's so cute. A little bow on the foot. Oh, ah, come on. What's going on here? We're having problems getting that. I don't know what the problem is. Oh, the shoe is bent up in the back. Okay, seriously? I never have any problems putting on shoes until right now. It's always got to be when you're recording stuff. You have a problem. There we go. Okay. Woo. Oh, she's all dressed. Looking super cute. All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the morning routine with the six babies. Um, and thank you so much for watching.